And the first sign is D1. It means a roundabout mandatory driving direction. So you cannot go to the left. Eh? You must go to the right, of course. And the difference between the blue sign and this sign is the blue sign is on the roundabout itself. And this warns you for the roundabout. So this can be 100, 200 or 500 meters before the roundabout. Well, a question. You turn right. Do you have to give way to the cyclist who drives straight ahead? Yes or no? The right answer is yes, because drivers who stay on the roundabout drive straight ahead. They can make one round, two rounds, three rounds, how many rounds they want. And if you go off the roundabout, you must give way to all drivers who stay on the roundabout. Traffic sign D2 means it's a command for all drivers to pass the sign on the side indicated on the sign. So in this case, you must pass on the right. You are not allowed to pass this sign on the left. And on the picture, it's logic that you pass the sign on the right because you may not cross this solid line. Traffic sign D3. Sign may be passed on both sides. So in this case, you may pass the sign on the left and on the right. It's up to you. Sign D4. Command to follow the direction of travel indicated on the sign. So this means you may not go to the right, you may not turn to the left, and also you may not make a U-turn. There are many websites who tell you at this sign you may make a U-turn, but that's not allowed. How can you make a U-turn before turn left first? It's impossible. So you must, in this case, you must go straight. And on this sign, you can get oncoming traffic. This sign only tells something to you. You must go straight and don't tell anything to oncoming traffic. So, you want to make a U-turn when the traffic light has turned to green. Is that allowed? Yes or no? And believe me, the answer at the CBR is no. What other people want to tell you, it's, uh, it's allowed, you can go make a U-turn. No, you cannot. You must drive straight ahead. How can you make a U-turn? without turning left first. It's impossible. And you may not turn left first, you must drive straight ahead. No other choice. Traffic sign D5 command to follow the direction of travel indicated on the sign. And of course, it can be straight ahead. This sign can go to the right or can go to the left. And in this case, you must turn Right. And again, you can have oncoming traffic. You want to drive straight ahead. Is that allowed in this situation? Yes or no? And yes, you are because you drive in a car and not in a tractor. Uh, a tractor must go to the right. This sign means Sign is only for the tractor. If there was a sign of a car, you must go to the right. And if there was no bottom plate, you must go to the right. But in this case, you can drive straight ahead. Traffic sign D6. Command to follow one of the driving directions indicated on the sign. So you have a choice now. Huh? You may go straight ahead or you may turn to the right. But it's not allowed to turn left and it's not allowed to make a U-turn. The final sign, D7, 
command to follow one of the directions that indicated on the sign. And in this case, you may not drive straight ahead. You must turn to the left or to the right. Up to you.